Hello children, let's understand a wonderful concept of suspension. We are already dealt with the solutions. It's a good time to begin with suspensions. So look at the examples here. We have muddy water, we have medicines, we have wheat flour or chalk powder in water. What do they make? They make hazy and heterogeneous solutions, right? The particles are visible through naked eyes in which solids are dispersed in liquids. The particles of solutes remain suspended through the medium. That is, they are not stable. They can settle at the bottom when left undisturbed, right? So what are the properties of suspension? Why they are unstable? Why they settle at the bottom? They settle at the bottom because their particle size is very large. It is greater than 1000 nanometer and they can be filtered out with the filter paper. So can you separate mud from water? Yes, it is very easy because the uh, residue will have mud and the filtrate will be water. Uh, when a beam of light is passed through the suspension, the particles scatter the light and make the light path visible. We have seen in the activity also. On leaving a suspension undisturbed, what will happen? The particles settle at the bottom and suspension becomes unstable. Right? I hope you have understood. Thank you.